Good morning, guys. It's just me and little baby Taika. And as you can see, today is a super chill day. No work, no obligations. So I'll be spending most of my day with this little man right here, Biden, hanging out at home. Since it's been really, really busy, I think we might just stay in and just really bond as a family because that is also very important, but we'll see. Since I'm staying in, I like to take my protein as early as possible because then that leaves open options as to what I get to order and eat for the rest of the day. So I got my protein, but the problem is it's powder form. And usually during the week, since I'm always grabbing protein from Barb, I'm getting the drink form. So I don't even have a legit protein shaker, but I just remember Vanity Planet, shout outs to you guys. They did send me a brand new one. It's a FitMix Pro. And I really like working with Vanity Planet because they always send me all their new new and I get to use it. And if you look at all the vlogs, I still use the scale to this day and all their products are good. And more importantly, besides sending me brand new stuff uh, for me to check out and try, like some new next level button pushing stuff, they always like are forward in technology. They always hook me up to give you guys a super dope discount code so you can get hella discount off. Now I'm gonna have to close the camera because as you can see, um, there's a little sticky and I'm not gonna be able to open this with the camera. So hold on a second. I'm discovering this with you guys and it's really cool because I thought it was just gonna be a shaker, um, like a high quality shaker that contains its protein, but it's actually um, gonna be powered. So you could put this in here and I'll spin that thing and I don't know if there's power on right now. Let me see. No, it's not. It's in the box. But it comes with a cord. So I could charge this thing. And then I'll have this a whisk on the inside. Which will unclump the protein. So that's pretty cool. So I'm going to try to charge it for a little bit. And then I'm going to use it. I just rinsed this real quick. Just so it's clean before I test it out. Okay, let's see if I can put this on with one hand. Alright. So I put it on. And after you load your water, protein, whatever fluid you want, you spin, bam. And that's how it works. It's going to mix it all up. It even has a little container up here to uh, store your protein before you mix it. <laughs> Ty goes with his mommy right now. Good boy. Do you want protein? Do you want protein, baby? You're too young for protein, you silly. All right, so this is pretty cool. It has measurements. So this specific brand of protein needs 12 ounces of cold water. So I put that in. I have the base right here. I'm gonna connect it. You probably don't wanna turn on the button without the top, because it's probably just gonna splash everywhere. And time to put this powder in here. Shout out to Paul Gomez for the Progenix protein powder. Some high quality stuff. Put this guy in here. And then, let's see, let's see how well it mixes it. Make sure everything is nice and tight, don't want any accidents. It is a rest day, I ain't trying to do no work. All right, ready? Get set, go. Oh, dang, that works pretty good. Wow, this is pretty powerful. That's what? dope. This is the Vita Goods protein. This is cool, huh? That's really cool. I love how it's clear. Yeah, so I'm just. A for good design. Yeah, it's clear. And just... Are you serious? Yeah, oh, I don't even have to keep my finger on it. It keeps going. That's cool. <laughs> Ma Bear's with the. I'm so nosy. Ma Bear's nosy with little baby Tyka right now. That is pretty cool, huh? That's super cool. So it's, it just keeps going, and uh, you could charge this overnight, and then so you can take it, it doesn't have to be plugged in. It's actually portable. Pretty cool, huh? Yeah, so make sure you go in the link below and... Uh, I need that. You're going to ask them to send another one? I need that in my life. So I'll get them to send me another one, but make sure you go in the link below. There's probably a discount code there. Check that out. Go to the website and you can get you guys one of these things. This is really convenient. Oh, cool. Look how frothy it is. It's like it's been shaken now. Hell yeah. Okay, now we're going to finish watching Thor because we were watching it last night. And uh, we didn't finish because we both fell asleep. It's tired, uh, tired, hashtag tired parents, hashtag no sleep, hashtag I never use hashtags. Alright, so today is family fun day. It's don't wear makeup day too, which I absolutely love. 
We got Taika Malaika in the ones and twos. Spit it, spit it as my little moose. And we got Paw Bear with the three little bears. And then we got, what are these guys? And we're not, we're not too keen to nature. But are they geese? Are they just duck? They're like what geeses. is that? They're what? Gooses. They're geese? I don't know what they are. They're huge though. Yeah, what, look at them. They don't give any fucks about anything. This is their turf. They look pretty badass. They're beautiful. Look at this. Well, I'm excited. Never been here before. So let's explore, baby. You ready? You're ready. I think you're ready. Let's go. Oops, sorry, dude. You gotta learn how to squint your eyes, my man. There you go. Look at that. This is awesome. There's up all these ducks too, all over there. Cool, oh my gosh, this place is, look at that. We can rent little carts, like little bike carts and just go around the whole park and get on the water. This is amazing. This is so cool, guys. Can't wait to hear, what the hell kind of face is that? Are you squished? <laughs> you look a little squished. Can't wait till you're old enough so we can do it. All right, we gotta go over this line. Ugh. It's pooping. The poop master pooped. I know, you look so happy when I saw this guy. I would've just stepped in it. Oh, he's still going. Damn, he's letting it all out. Oh my God, it smells so bad. You guys, it smells really bad. I'm getting away from that. Oh, they're flying. The ducks are flying. Okay, those are dogs. For sure those are dogs. But the other big things, what were they? Were they geeses? Alright, so we're gonna be those guys and we're gonna interrupt the fucking ducks. What are these guys? Tell me. Look at that goes Papa. They're gonna attack. They're gonna fight back. I hope they attack. We're on their turf. This guy right here, they don't trust us at all. They were like cussing at us because they're like, God damn it. We were just trying to chill. What the fuck? But they don't go too far. They're so used to people. Sorry, my dude. Yeah, they don't just run away. No. They get like this guy. He's like, try me, dude. Try my dog. That's so cool. Look at how close they are to each other. These guys don't care. Taika is with his moose. Oh my God. He's like, Holding himself, because you're a moose today. You're a moose today. Good boy. He's sucking on the moose hook. Yeah. That looks better. There we go. Oh, that's a little too dark. Whoa. They sound like a car alarm. God, they're so beautiful. Remember the one? We saw black ones in Japan. Oh, yeah. And we saw black ones in Switzerland. Oh, yeah. Those are awesome, too. I feel so well-traveled. Those guys were freaking <clears throat> ice cold water. It was ice cold. Watch the vlog. When I mean, we're in Switzerland, watch that vlog. It's really cool. All right, I felt really bad for Taika and his little jacket. This is not cold at all. Um, but I thought it was going to be, but I just left them in it because parents, you know, once you put them in this little carrier, taking them in and out of it is kind of a hassle, especially when he barely has any headroom. So he's already out, sort of outgrowing this. So I took off his jacket. He's way more comfy. I have a blanket ready to cover his face in case the sun's all over it again. And Paw Bear has decided to let Meatloaf off a leash, which is okay, because Meatloaf is actually the best listener of the three. These two bitches over here, yeah, he really, he listens really well. Uh, these two bitches look at each other and they're like, ready, set, go! And then they're just like in their own little bubble and we no longer exist. All right, so Papa had a really good idea. We're gonna walk to the middle of that thing, whatever that thing is called. Can you take a picture of me on it and put it on Instagram? Yeah. Let's go off-roading, my dude. You look unbelievably comfortable. Oh, look what he caused. Okay, let's see if Mama could do this. One hand on you, one hand on camera. We're gonna go really, really slow. You trust me so much, my love. You have no idea the death that's right in front of you. I'm just kidding. You're safe. Ooh, the sun, the sun, the sun. 
Yeah. Let me just not kill our son first, but I'll get a picture. Oh, okay. I'm gonna go there anyway. Yeah. Look at these guys. There's so many different species of this bird. Or birds. Is that right? Does that make sense? What? Species? Yeah. Of birds? See all the duck shit now? Yeah, this is a bunch of duck shit. It's okay. We're walking through a bunch of dirt anyway. Oh my god, you are getting blasted, my son. Blasted no more. Mama got you covered, finally. Oh shit, there's a pelican too. What the hell? I don't even know if we're supposed to be walking over here, but we're doing it. And it's disgusting. Look at this. Ugh. All right, just finished our little park walk and Pop Bear had this awesome idea of getting Froyo. And it's super cutie because you never like to share what's going on. I have allergies, my allergies are going crazy today. Oh, Pop Bear never likes to share, but this time because he's still on a diet, we're sharing. And Taika Malika didn't want any. Huh? You didn't want any? I put a little bit. No. He's only used to the good, good, like the organic stuff. Okay, fine. He doesn't know, uh, his body doesn't know the uh, refined sugars yet. That's true. Processed sugars. That's true. He's so pure and perfect. My organic baby. All babies are organic, by the way. All right, guys. So outfit number one, and I think the only one that really wait. We're too. I'm too blown out. Hold on. Look at Papa's outfit. Looking a little fly, fly. And we're here to support our friend's grand opening. I'll show you what it is when I'm inside. First, I'm gonna get my boy <laughs> ready and out of the car. So we're in Pop Bear's old stomping grounds. How does it feel? It to feels be back? very nostalgic. I haven't been back here since you graduated. Since I graduated, so like 2010. So it's been eight years. Um, a lot of things have changed. I was just looking at stores and stuff, and it's really ironic because um, my buddy just opened up a matcha green tea place in this whole like college town, and I'm also invested in uh, this company, but not this specific location. But it's, um, it's ironic because all the brands and companies are changing and one of them is changing into a company that I'm going to be a part ownership of. So it kind of like goes full circle. Went to school here, now opening up a business here. Not directly because I don't own this one, but I'm involved in the whole development of it. But I'm really happy to be able to see uh, my friend's place because then I'll know what our Chinatown location is going to taste like. But in terms of this specific area, I love college towns because there's always like this energy about it. Like everyone's always learning, wide-eyed. Like they're never like this guy. Like this guy, like a wide-eyed. <laughs> you ready to learn, Mister? You ready to learn? Was he, I wonder if he was sleeping and for how long. I know. He's Don't go to UCLA like the Papa. Hey. hey! No college for you though. College is a waste of time <laughs> for everyone. Just kidding. I learned a lot from college. I loved coming to school here. I wish I would have spent like six years in college. I learned so much here. But you spent it six years in high school. Oh! Five years in high school. I was smart. I spent five years in high school. <laughs> okay, fine. Alright, so like Bart mentioned, it's a matcha and tea spa and the inside's so cool. Look at this. They give you the basics. What matcha means, which a lot of people don't know, and it's ground tea. Uh, they explained everything. It's gluten free, everyone, if you guys cared. And then these are our friends. It's Jeremy, Anna, June, and Dan, and they're the ones that started this. And this is June. She always has like the coolest art on her nails, like every month. I always look forward to looking at her nails. Look at that. So if I had to look at this, I'm assuming that that's where it's sourced from. So it goes from Japan to LA, China back to LA, Taiwan and India. And I feel like literally these are like the spots where um, tea is like the best. So I'm already, I'm already a big, big fan. I have oolong tea, which I always get in Chinese places, Earl Grey, I don't know where I get those. Uh, awesome tea and then green tea, green tea of course. It's really good in Taiwan and Japan. Look at that, and it's good for you. It's detoxifying for your body. And no jitters, I really appreciate that, for sure. Look at that. Uh, my little, my little Bruin. What? I'm 
gonna tell them something because everything looks great except for jam and tea. So, tell them. That's why it's good to have uh, these little soft, soft openings. openings. Yeah. Fix little things here and there. <laughs> that's a good eye because for me it's the same thing. I can't, I can't tell the difference. That's why they have me here. What else? What is, I don't know. I don't what know. is that? Is that? Everything seems bright so far. Okay, fine. That works. All right, and then you have your menu. What are you gonna get, baby? Um, so I know they're known for their matcha. So I definitely get matcha something with some boba. Oh yeah, that's all of them. And then we have Michael, Michael motorcycle. I'm not gonna interrupt him. He's talking to his lady. I also like Earl Grey though. And it's from Loose Leaf, so they're brewing it fresh from Loose Leaf, not chopped up. Ceremonial? What? Maybe blueberry matcha milk tea. I'll try that. That sounds pretty refreshing. It's kind of a hot day. It is pretty hot. I love that I can. He's like about to kick this, and he's like with his little moose. Yeah, I think I'm gonna try that. So we'll see how this goes. I think this is a genius idea um, because one, it's in a town that's very progressive, like West. This is Westwood, right? Yeah, Westwood. That's a college town. See, welcome to SIP. Uh, I'm so proud of our friends. We got some really talented friends. What about this guy? His ear keeps getting bent. We gotta fix this ear. Hey, the baby is out. Hi, girl. Flirting with all the girls already. Are you getting hungry? Yeah. He ate before we left. I was hoping he wanted some tea. Do you want tea, mister? No, my mom Mr. said Tiger. I can't have it. Why not? What if daddy says he could? Uh, daddy doesn't own this child. I own this child. Daddy just pays. Daddy does own this guy. Yeah, right. He doesn't look oh, like you at all. My he looks just like me. No, look, look at me. Who looks more like who? Good boy. Okay. This is all socks. Alright, so I just got my salmon oni matcha. Look how cute this is. And now it's time that I use, that I try. Do you want to try it first? Do you want to try it first? Ooh, this, is, this is really dope because we both ordered uh, our own thing. But what's really cool is mine came out first because it's fresh and they don't want it to get cold. Since he got here, I know because you know, he got little Yokozuna legs. Yakitori slice. <laughs> and then this is June. Tell us about this space. About this place? Yeah, and when's it gonna open? What it is? Yes, so we're doing a soft opening. I don't know. I'm, I feel like if I tell them we're doing soft opening, it's like they're just gonna rush it. Yeah, yeah, no, which is good. Okay, yeah, so we're doing them. a soft opening next week, but we're gonna be grand opening in a few weeks because we really wanna make sure we get all the kinks out. But if you guys come in before then, we really wanna hear your feedback and what you like, what could be better. So please come, matcha everything here. We'd love to see you. What is the recommended drink, your personal favorite so they know what to order, and then anything else. My favorite drink, if I'm going to be like, if it's super hot out and wants to be refreshing, is the aloe matcha. It is aloe, and then I like to get the aloe bits, and then there's matcha on top. It's beautifully layered. And then my favorite milky drink, I'd say is the magic matcha. There's magic, turmeric, and meat. It's that three-color layer drink you guys have seen on Instagram. You shake it from side to side. Oh my God. Uh, I don't know if I'll make it look as good as the future. And I'm always like watching her 
eat. And I feel kind of weird because I'm like, yes, get more noodles in your mouth. They look so good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll have to do one together. We'll have to do one. Okay, we'll do it. Okay. We're not gonna, what am I going to do? Yeah, we're going to do it. No, we're going to do it. All right, so now we are walking around. What is this area called? Westwood Village. Westwood Village. So if you see us, come say, oh my gosh, she almost, she almost died. <laughs> this is where I used to see all the honey spit game at James Franco. Oh, here? There'd be like eight hot ass girls, and I'm like, how come I've never been in a study group like that? Because you're not hot. Or James Franco. Hey, but you got a hot girl. You got a hot girl. You know girl what? I had, I had James Franco's. I had James Franco's autograph. Yeah, yeah. And you know what happened to it? I threw it away because I'm like, who the hell is this? It's trash, and I crumbled it up. Are you there? There. Is that what happened? I, I asked James Franco for an autograph, right? You're gonna and, go and, off the curb. And then when we first moved in together, uh, we were like cleaning stuff out, and I'm like, hey, babe, you see that folder with the paper in front of it? She goes, yeah, I threw it away. I'm like, that's yeah. James Franco's autograph. Oh yeah, and how many Oscars has he won? No one cares. I will say this. He's about to. Probably the Damn reason why you didn't have ladies in front of you is because you thought uh, Dickie was a suit at the time, so. <laughs> <laughs> Times have changed. They matched, all right? <laughs> so this has to be my favorite wardrobe on Taika. Look at him, out and about. It just is with the onesie. Look at, you feel comfortable now? He was so red and so hot. We got a table. Oh. Okay, we're eating at CPK. Thank you. All right, we're home now, and the very, very first thing I did as soon as I got home was feed Taika. <laughs> we had to feed him because he was crying. Look at, it. he was crying in the car. So, we're feeding him. But the second thing I immediately did was change into what I really like to wear, which is this comfy robe because I always love when Taika hugs me. It's like a blanket for him. So comfy robe for Taika. And now I'm ready to hang out. It feels so nice to be home. Like I'm so proud of everyone at SIP, my friends. Uh, June, Dan, Anna, Jeremy, David and Joe because they uh, all invest into this company. I'm so proud of the product, the way the place looks. Like if you guys are in the Westwood area, um, check out SIP. It's really really good i love it it's so good we even went back a second time just to get uh this one's earl gray and this one is the blueberry matcha again <sighs> so good i wish you could taste it my dude but it's okay in due time right baby in due time so i'm gonna wait for him to finish his bottle then i'm gonna take him out of his car seat because i feel like uh i feel like i don't want to interrupt his eating because like i hate when i'm eating and then i have to move or stop or whatever. I just hate that I have to stop eating. So I'm gonna let him finish and then I'm gonna take him out. My naked boy. He was so hot. He was so hot today, huh? He was so hot today, huh? Damn those eyebrows. You got some good eyebrows, my dude. You're welcome. They came from my side. But your eyes are beautiful too. You got beautiful eyes. <sighs> you don't really have eyebrows, my girlfriend. I'm gonna dry some eyebrows for you. Fawn's got some eyebrows. They're little, how fun. What are you looking at? That's scary. Fawn, there's nothing up there. Stop looking up there. That's scary. She keeps looking up. There's nothing up there. Don't freak me out. What is she looking at? What are you looking at? That's freaking me out, dude. Look, she's doing it again. Yeah, that's back there. I think Bart's peeing. Can you guys hear that? That's how quiet this house is. So now I hope y'all understand why we have white noise maker for these dogs. Because if anyone walks by the neighborhood, they hear it outside. There's nothing up there. Anyway, <laughs> I'm going to just turn on the TV and forget that she didn't freak me the hell out. You're almost done. <sighs> Keep doing that. That makes me so happy. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So we just put the baby to sleep and it's ma bear and pa bear time. So we ordered some food. What did we order? Oh, um, sush magoosh. Japanese hand rolls specifically. Oh, hand rolls specifically. Right. Um, and we're kind of going to make it a date night. We'll see how long that lasts. 
Really? Remember we tried to we tried to watch well, All Eyes on Me, the Tupac movie, we both knocked out. Well, two things happened with that. The first one is the movie just wasn't that good. Sorry if you liked the movie, it just wasn't my thing. I didn't think it was. Uh, I just thought it was poorly done. It was a bad movie. Um, and secondly, we were laying down on the couch, which is the worst position if you're already kind of tired. Uh, so that date night kind of turned into sleep in 20 minutes. So we're going to sit up. But I know someone that's notorious for the Whoa, minute Whoa, what's happening? Whoa, no. I know someone that's incredibly beautiful, a strong, independent woman. Uh, that's notorious. Whoa. For, uh, a strong, independent Whoa. woman. A uh, very strong, very independent, very beautiful, and very athletic. But notorious for laying oh. down, notorious for laying down and getting comfortable, and then knocking up. <gasps> Briggy, is that you? Very beautiful, athletic, but always sleeping. All right, who is that? Is that Meatloaf, or is that Fawn? Is that Meatloaf or Fawn? Go, 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 go. Meatloaf, Meatloaf. It's Meatloaf, and that's Fawn. Did you guys do good? Did you guys do good? Anyway, what the hell? Are you really falling asleep already? No, I feel pretty tired though. Too bad, you gotta suck it up. We gotta have fucking date night, alright? We're gonna fucking do it. We're gonna have a good time. We're gonna have a fucking good time. You got that? You got that? Huh? <laughs> You're evil. What? You're evil to even think of that. Oh I blew my in his God. eyeballs. You're evil. Pure evil. But not this guy. This guy's sleeping and he's pure cutie. Alright, we're gonna watch a movie. I think we're watching Thor. We've never seen it. And I'm gonna make it a little bit of a romantic by turning off the lights. Oh, that's on. Let's take our time tonight. I don't know the lyrics. Alright, fuck it. All right, we're going to watch this, and we're going to wait for our food to arrive. Ooh, la la. What do you've got here? I've got kazu, kazunori, kazunori. Ooh, so dinner has arrived, which means, hey, 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 stop it. Fun. Which means they're going to sniff the hell out of the bag, but no. That means that we're going to have dinner. And I'm gonna have to end the vlog here because we want to flirt with each other without you guys making fun of us. So thank you guys so much <laughs> for spending. Make, uh, take, uh, brother no, we're not. Sister. Ew, no, we're not. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed our day today and see you guys tomorrow.